Hi guys, so it's me McKenna and I'm going to be doing a video on Girl Meets World. So I really like this show and it's one of the, I haven't really liked a lot of Disney shows in the past few years but even though I was barely born when Girl Meets World ended, I remember seeing reruns because I think my sister really liked it. I'm pretty sure, because I know I've seen it. And so, I am so excited for this show, and I think it's really easy, and I know because I'm older than them I shouldn't be, but I feel like I really relate to the characters, and it's really good. I've seen the first three episodes, and my best friend's even like, you watch it too much, because... I just like it so much that I'm watching every episode over and over and over again, which there's also a lot of TV shows that I can't do that, because it's like, you're not, you've already seen what happens, so there's nothing surprising. But it's actually a show that I can watch over and over again, and I even drew the logo for this one instead of just writing it, because I like it so much. So. Out of all of the characters, I think I relate most to Riley, who's the lead in it. She's the girl who's meeting the world. And then, but I really like Serena Carpenter. I just don't relate to her character that much. But I love her music, and Can't Blame a Girl for Trying is my favorite song. I also like Take on the World, though. That's the theme song of Girl Meets World. And... Yeah, and then Lucas. Oh, Lucas is so cute, and I love Peyton Meyer. I would say right now he's, like, my celebrity crush, if you could even call him a celebrity. To me, he's a celebrity because I love him. And, <laughs> yeah, um, yeah, Buckle. Buckle is just as funny as can be. And... He, um, Corey Fog Fogamelis, I don't know that I'm pronouncing his last name right, but I think he does really great with the character. He's very funny. He's got a lot of, um, he just brings so much to the character that I feel like it makes you believe that he is that character. And so, yeah, um... Augie, he's just a cute little five-year-old. I don't think he's actually five in real life, but in the show he plays a little five-year-old. And he plays Augie, he plays Riley's little brother, and he's just cute and lovable and funny in the little kid way. And then, of course, Cory and Topanga are back. It's so cool to watch them be adults now because I loved what I love watching reruns of Boy Meets World and so yeah and they're just so cute to like see a bunch of years later and I'm excited for the rest of the cast to come back from Boy Meets World because I just want to see what happened to all of them and see if maybe we get a little more of their story and yeah so watch Girl Meets World it's on Fridays on Disney Channel at 8.30 and it's awesome. Yeah. So go check it out.